Hello everyone, Mr. Kaczynski here. Uh, Algebra 1 section of IXL, we're going to deal with polynomials today. The third skill in that section is adding and subtracting polynomials using algebra tiles. Good place to start for us as far as uh, combining polynomials together. So we're given uh, this set of polynomials, or two polynomials that we want to add together. 10x squared plus x plus 9 is represented here on the left. 10x squared plus 10x plus 5 is represented here on the right. All right, so we're going to put all these together. So obviously, this is our 10x squareds. And then we've got another 10x squareds over here on the right. And we want to add those together. So that'll be a 20x squared. Sorry for the hesitation. Then uh, we've got 1x here. And we've got another 10x's over here on the right. Together, that makes 11x's. And we've got our 9 1's on the left polynomial. And another 5 over here on the right. 9 plus 5 is 14. So that would be our new polynomial. 20x squared plus 11x plus 14. That's it. We're just adding them both together. Things get a little trickier, I guess, with... Um, subtraction though. So we have 10x squared plus 5x plus 8 over here on the left and we're going to subtract 5x squared uh, plus 2. So it's really that we've got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5x squareds that we need to subtract over here from the left which just leaves us with 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. 10x squared minus 5x squared is 5x squared. Um, there aren't any x's that are being subtracted, so we'll just keep these five x's that are in the polynomial on the left. But we do have two ones that need to be subtracted from the left. So that leaves us with one, two, three, four, five, six. Again, I think if we just do eight minus two, that's six, just like x 10x squared minus 5x squared is 5x squared. But we're getting to that eventually. Algebra tiles help show it a little bit. All right, now um, some negatives, but the process is still the same. We're adding these two polynomials, 3x squared minus 2x plus 1, and 2x squared minus 3x. So we've got 1, 2, 3, plus 1, 2 gives us 5x squared. 3x squared plus 2x squared is 5x squared. Um, next, the x terms, they're all negatives. So negative 1, negative 2, negative 3, negative 4, negative 5 x's. Again, negative 2x plus negative 3x is negative 5x. And then we do have the one single uh, unit, algebra tile. And so we'll just put plus 1. So the sum of these two polynomials is 5x squared minus 5x plus 1. What about subtraction of negatives? Again, the process remains kind of the same here. So now we're subtracting this polynomial on the right from the polynomial on the left. So look at the 6x squareds minus the 5x squared. So we've got 5 that need to be subtracted from the left. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 are gone. That just leaves us with 1. So 1x squared, we're not going to put the 1 in front. Um, there aren't any x terms on the right, so we'll just count up these ones that we have on the left, and that's negative 4x. It's right there, negative 4x. Just like 6x squared minus 5x squared was 1x squared. And then we do have uh, 6 negative 1s that are being subtracted from the negative ones on the right. So one, two, three, four, five, six gone. That leaves us with that one right over here. So negative one. So um, on that one, negative seven minus negative six is like negative seven plus six, which is negative one. So there's our new trinomial. All right, last one. And this one gets a little tricky because we've got some subtraction of negatives. Okay, 
uh, 4x squared, but we're subtracting 2x squared. That's really like adding 2x squared. So that's where I think the algebra tile idea kind of runs out on us a bit. Um, so 6x squared because 4x squared minus negative 2x squared is like 4x squared plus 2x squared, which is 6x squared. We've only got the one negative x, so no need to worry about subtracting anything from that. And then we've got, we're subtracting 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8 negative 1s. That's really like adding um, eight ones to these five. So that's going to be plus 13. I think that's really confusing with the algebra tiles. Um, but it's just, to me, if I look at the original expression, five minus negative eight, that's like five plus eight, which is 13. So there's our new polynomial when we subtract these two from each other. Six X squared minus X plus 13. All right, so this is adding and subtracting polynomials using algebra tiles. Um, in future, a future skill, we'll show you how to do it without the algebra tiles, which you might even like better.